YouTube, what is up? Right now we are going to talk about five things that I think could improve in Animal Crossing New Horizons. Uh, now the first one, I think everybody is going to be in agreement with me on, and that is the ability to craft all when it comes to fish bait. There is nothing worse than sitting here and just spamming the A button as I slowly craft through multiple fish bait. Um, I, I really wouldn't have an issue if Twitch made me watch that little hammer uh, series for like the same amount of time. Just don't make me click through all these menus. I, I don't care if this takes longer if I have more pieces of fish bait, but the fact that you have to sit here and craft through this, you know, however many times for fish bait, it is silly and it adds no value to the game. If anything, it just irritates people. Um, so as you can see, I just made five fish bait. Um, that should not take that long. That's It's just silly to me that it, it takes that long. Uh, the next thing up that I want to talk about is actually the tool wheel. So if you look at my tool wheel, there are, let's see, eight slots. Um, which works unless you start using a wand. Then... The wand, unfortunately, takes the slot of, like, the ladder, so now my ladder isn't on, you know, my tool wheel, which is incredibly annoying and frustrating because, well, really the wand shouldn't be something that is taking away my ability to use all my tools when the wand is a pretty, like, big feature of the game. Also, I cannot get this slingshot um to me it's really it's really frustrating that you know i have to essentially choose which tool i don't want to have and be inconvenienced by the fact that you know instead of putting nine tools on here because there are you know nine tools that most people carry once you get a wand i have to then go in here to my ladder if i want to use my ladder hold it and uh then be able to use it Right, that, that to me is very annoying, and it just seems like, you know, silly that they have eight slots for tools instead of nine on this wheel. Um, to me, that's just, it's a small thing, but it, it, it irritates me. Now, I don't usually use the ladder on my own island, but, you know, when you're visiting other people's islands that maybe they're still building it, they don't have all the ramps or everything, or, you know, maybe it's easier to use it. The fact that you then have to click through a couple other times to me is, um, you know, is really annoying. Now, one of the other things I'd like to see improved is the Able Sisters. So the first thing, this is kind of like part A, part B. Um, you know, when we come in here to Able Sisters, I'm in my wand. It, why can't I wear my wand outfit into here? That to me is, is frustrating. So now I have to then change it. Um, if we just go back to the normal one, we'll wear this. And really the bigger gripe I have with Able Sisters is, um, the fact that there's not a cart, like a shopping cart here. Like, let's say I like these hoodies, right? I like these hoodies, I'd like to buy all, all, all what is this, eight of them. I want to buy all eight of them. Well, I can't. I have to buy this, then I'd have to, you know check out um and then once i check out then i can come back and buy the other colors again to me it's just really frustrating that i can't buy all of these at once um and just add it all to a cart instead of having to go through it like this where okay i like that shirt now i want it in a different color so let's go find a different color and then we're gonna gonna have to check out again and we'll keep repeating this process you know until we've bought all the colors that we were interested in um you know to me that's just kind of silly that we have to go through all of these button clicks when you know i should be able to just come in here and if i want to spend fifty thousand bells you know to just buy everything that i want then you know let me do that um that that to me is really frustrating just time-consuming that you have to kind of continuously go in and out of the same 
little dressing room to get things that you know you know you want and you can't just do it in one one easy um, buying situation or, or scenario um, the next thing we have that I would like to see improved is when we are using the terraforming and we're doing construction with the paths um, the button to place a path and to remove a path is the same so for example let's say we're gonna go down here right you press a and, and it lays the path but if I want to get rid of the path, it's also A. So I know, and I'm sure anybody who's been laying paths, if you don't get far enough away, kind of like, I thought I was far enough beyond this path, right? Like, I'm going to lay the next one, but if, if you're not far enough up, well, it then deletes the path. And it's just, it's a small quality of life improvement that I really don't know why they didn't make, like, place the path A and then, you know, remove the path as, like, B or Y or X or literally anything other than A. Um, to me, it's just one of those really annoying features that when you're trying to, you know, make paths and make them look good and really build a whole path out that it can just really frustrate you and annoy you because I know it's happened to me a couple times and you, it just is silly, really. Um, and the last thing that I think Animal Crossing really could improve on, uh, the fifth and final thing for me is the load screens and the amount of time it takes to load when you are traveling to a friend's island. Um, now I don't know if that's a, an issue with Nintendo Online and it's like a greater issue. You know that that's beyond just an Animal Crossing thing but to me it's it's insane you know when you're trying to like bring a number of people together it can take you like 15 minutes just to get everybody on the island just because you have to wait and let each individual person load in Everybody has to watch the loading screen, and uh, to me that's just incredibly frustrating, um, you know, for a game that seemingly, you know, other games they can load straight into instances like in Mario Kart and stuff. So I would definitely like to see uh, Animal Crossing work on that load screen and uh, that load time and get that all resolved. But with that being said, let me know down in the comments what you all would like to see improved. Those are five things that I think would make the game uh, much better. Uh, also, if you would all please like and subscribe to the channel, I would greatly appreciate it. And that way you will know when I post new videos. Thanks, and have a good one, everybody.